what is going on guys this is clutch once again and i have another squad builder for you this team has been given to me by arna and rai and it is an op motherfucking tank um but yeah before we get into building an actual team if you want to buy some fifa on my team coins check out fifautcoinstore.com the link will their links will be in the description but anyway getting into the team this team has a little bit of everything oh my god um in net we have sirigu who is op as hell um a really really good um i almost said center back really really good goalkeeper um, moving on to centre back, we have an OP motherfucker in Ogbonna, um, the Juventus version for chemistry reasons. Um, but moving on to the second centre back, we have another Juventus player. And if it would actually load, we have Chiellini, who is one of my favourite players on this game, one of my favourite defenders. His left foot is amazing. If you haven't had a long shot with Chiellini, I suggest you try it. Moving on to the third centre back and completing the trio of OPness, we have Vorsa. Not many people use Vorsa, I don't know why. He's got 77 pace, he's a monster, he's huge, great defending, great heading, he's just an animal. Absolutely, like some of these players I'd never used before, and I was like, what the fuck, why have I never used these players? Like this man here, um, first centre mid we have is Emmanuel Fringpong. Um, stay dentro, get from Pong. I said that in my last video, and I was like, What the fuck, never again. But I just did it again. Um, second defensive mid we have is El Amadi, along with Frim Pong, two defensive mids that I hadn't actually used until this team. Um, because I made this team before that over squad builder, um, just in case you're wondering why I said I've never used Frim Pong before. But anyway, um, these two are freaking amazing. Frim Pong has an amazing shot, El Amadi is. I thought from his picture, I thought he was like tiny and stuff, but no, he's pretty tall and he's got decent defending and he's good going forward. He's a good all round player. Moving on to right mid, we have the skill element of the team. We have Quincy, who is 92 pace. What, what more do I have to say? He's got a left foot on the right wing, and um, so he cuts inside, make a nice little scoop turn inside, or just like do a step over and cut inside and then smash it with his left foot and it's in. And moving on to left mid, we have the same concept with um, Asaidi who is two, he's, he's a second of the third five star skills in this team and he's as OP as Quincy, he's amazing. At first I was like nanny all day but then I tried a sidey and I was like eh. But for, for, the, for his price he's definitely more worth it than nanny to be honest. Uh, moving on to Cam we have the third five star skiller who is Tarapt. So, so far we've got a, a strong defense, strong defensive mid and a skill part of the midfield now we go to the op motherfuckers of the strikers um first striker we have is marco royce where are you there you are we've got royce up front and then to finish it off the sweaty motherfucker himself the king of sweat s line who is everyone's nightmare when they're against him and everyone's best friend when they're on his team as i found out because he's amazing i'm putting him in over there because Every time I play with a 3 5 2, my left striker seems to play better and get more opportunities, and I want S1 on the ball. So, yeah, thanks to Danny for suggesting this team. Um, if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe if you're new. But until next time, it has been Clutch. Peace! Don't let my swagger face ya. I'm a cool motherfucker, but chill, cause I got something tucked in my blazer.